Chris Profi, musically obsessed. Chris Profi, musically obsessed with vinyl CDs and cassettes. Chris Profi, musically obsessed. Oh yeah! All right, today I want to talk about one of my favorite bass players, Chuck Dukowski. But I want to show you the stuff that he recorded when he was not in Black Flag. So, let's get into it. Chuck Dukowski has a very unique bass style. I love it, and for me, I can always hear his bass style. He has certain little intervals that he does and a songwriting technique that, to me anyways, it screams Chuck Dukowski. So, his first band, pre-Black Flag, was a band called Worm. And this is actually a Record Store Day compilation of all of their recordings. They recorded a full length on SST, uh, as well as in uh, a single... And then this kind of collects some, some live demos and things like that as well. But, uh, you know, in your face punk, that's what Worm was. He was in an instrumental band called October Faction with um, Greg Ginn on guitar from Black Flag and some other SST superstars. And October Faction released uh, a couple of instrumental albums on the label. And they're very, they're, they're interesting, I shall just say. Um, and like some of these other instrumental releases that I'm going to show you, Chuck Dukowski kind of found a way to mix punk, like uh, free jazz and sort of, psych rock and sludge sludgy metal and kind of mix them all together for a unique style but october faction very cool instrumental band he was also in one of my favorite sst bands swa i've got quite a bit of their stuff this isn't everything i have but i've got their album volume this album with a roman numeral i i can't rem i was never good at roman numerals but Seals with Antlers, we'll just call it. Your Future, if you have one. One of my favorite SWA albums, Winter. And all these albums, you have the great Merrill Ward on vocals. And he was also in a band called Overkill. No, not that metal Overkill. SST's Overkill. It's probably my favorite SWA. Well, I said, win did I say Winter was my favorite? If I did, this is... Just as good. Swaz Sex Doctor. And um, there's Chuck Dukowski right there. Looking all dapper. Uh, he was also in a band that uh, I believe only released one album. And I heard about this through one of my viewers. He's like, Chris, have you ever heard of this? Chuck Dukowski's in this band. They're called United Gang Mem Members. UGM, and this came out on the New Alliance label, I want to say, back in 1994. This, again, is more instrumental, jazzy, psych rock, sludgy, punk, all mixed together. Very cool. United Gang members. And then also he was in uh, a band called Chuck Dukowski Sextet, and his wife actually sings in this band, and I believe his stepson is in this band as well. I love the album covers for these albums. Check this out. The Chuck Dukowski Sextet, Reverse the Polarity, and uh, Haunted, and Eat My Life. So they all sort of have this very colorful theme to them. And again, more free jazz, punk, but now you've got the female vocals on top. So again, you're going to get, you know, like a Sonic Youth vibe. You'll get like a whole vibe. 
they actually even cover the song My War, which was a huge song for Black Flag. They do a version on this album, Eat My Life. They do a version of uh, My War, and it's killer. So there you go. I, I don't think that this is everything that Chuck Dukowski has played with and played on, but this is just some stuff that you should check out because he is a phenomenal bass player and he doesn't get talked about enough. All right, everyone. Happy Friday. Enjoy your weekend. Bye.